everybody, welcome to another season, the 30th year of Operation Football. Westfield with a big game against New Pal. Let's kick it off with some highlights right now. What a way to get it rolling once again. The Shamrocks score on their first drive. Quarterback Jackson Gilbert with a keeper for the TD. 7-0 Rocks. Westfield in sync from the start, including the defense. New Palace picked off. Brock Stewart with the sweet play. I need that. Oh, 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 oh. And the Shamrocks turn it into points. Jackson Gilbert, beautiful pass to Bo Brown for the 38-yard touchdown. Westfield with a strong opening night, winning 34-14. Let's head to Hamilton Southeastern. The Royals are ready to chase that Operation Football Spirit Award once again. HSC up 14-0 on Carroll. And watch this, their defense goes to work. Back-to-back -back sack attacks. And little Evie stayed up late for this big game. And it was a good one. Carroll comes back. Brayton Steely with a quarterback keeper in the third to make it a seven-point game. But the Royals rise again. Mason Alexander with the interception, and watch him go. 59 yards for the touchdown, his second pick six of the night. Yes, Royal Nation rises again as they win 28-14. On Operation Football, Dominic Miranda has more highlights right after this. Welcome back to Operation Football, everybody. Dominic Miranda hanging out here at Bishop Shatar. Listen, you can't talk about Indiana high school football without talking about the Trojans, the defending state champs in 3A, preseason number one in 3A, welcoming in Burbuff Jesuit. Just look at these students, man. They are ready to rock. The Trojans brought the heat, but it was the Braves with the first impact play. Ball's on the deck. Javon Brooks the recovery. We're heading the other way. Very next play, Maverick Geske up top to Taylor Clark. <laughs> 62 yards to the house. It's seven nothing for Buff. Trojans look to answer. Aiden Ortega heaves. It's picked. <laughs> Dylan Wells all the way down to the eight yard line. The Braves would tack on a field goal, making it 10 nothing, just like that. Chatard found success with Riley Kinnett on the ground. A tough runner. Field goal attempt to get on the board. No dice from 32 yards. But don't let these highlights fool you. Chatard storms back and dominates for Buck. Final score, 49-23. Let's head to Warren Central. A heavyweight fight between the Warriors and Fort Wayne Snyder. It's 8-0 Warren Central second quarter. Get to know the name Karan Billingsley. Small but mighty. 20 yards to the barn. The Warriors cling to an 8-7 lead. Trying to make something happen here. Keith Jackson high into the sky. Intercepted by Levi Overholzer. And Snyder would capitalize. Billingsley again won't go down. 20 yard touchdown to put Snyder on top. 14-8 heading into the halftime break. Warren Central drops a tough week one matchup. Snyder 42, Warriors 20. For all your scores, head to our website, WTHR.com. Football is back.
Woo! <laughs>